Father, we just come before your holy throne. We ask that you forgive us of all sins we have committed against you and against your creation. Father, I ask for now according to your word in Psalm 34, verse 7, that you can your angels around all of us here in this broadcast around our loved ones, family members, ministry partners, in-laws, ex, in-laws, and friends to protect us and keep us safe from any form of retaliation or attacks of the devil and his demons. And we declare Isaiah 54, 17, no weapon formed against us shall prosper in the mighty name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. Welcome, everyone, to another live edition of our Global Spiritual Warfare Government Satellite Prayer Network 30-Day Intensive Deliverance Prayer by Brother Carlos. Amen. I lead people in this prayer, okay? I lead the prayer daily on behalf of everyone who has signed up for the 30-Day Intensive Deliverance until the 30 days up. When the 30 days up, sign up again. Praise God. Where can you sign up? Below this video or at BrotherCarlos.com. BrotherCarlos.com. Easy to remember. BrotherCarlos.com. Amen. How many of you can say amen right now? Praise Jesus. And basically what we do here, we intercede on behalf of these people who have signed up for this ministration. Amen. And for also for their families, for their entire household, for their pets, for their automobiles, everything. Also, on behalf of my ministry partners, those who sow financial seeds here regularly. Also, on behalf of myself and my family. And what is that that we do? We knock devils out. We cast them out and break curses. Is there anything better than that? Is there anything to do better than casting out demons and breaking curses? In Christianity, is there anything more exciting? Huh? I don't, I don't you know, salvation is great. You know, people need to get saved, of course, and then... What happens next after they get saved? Well, get rid of demons, right? How many people say they have confessed Jesus Christ as their Lord and Savior and they walk around possessed by evil spirits? Huh? The best good news is you confess Jesus as your Lord and Savior, okay? Romans 10, 9, okay? If you confess with your mouth Jesus is Lord and believe in your heart that God raised him from the dead, you'll be saved. Now, after you get saved, then what's next? Well, learn, you know, learn the word, you know, learn the principles from God and all that. And then what else? Get rid of demons. Do you have to study, you know, a whole three years, the word of God in order to be set free from? No, you can start getting free from demons immediately after you get saved. Immediately start knocking them out. You can open your big mouth and say, demons, come out in Jesus' name. You should be doing that all, uh, every day, all day long. Praise God. Hallelujah. So that's what I do. Okay. And we've been doing that every single day. We are now what? Mid-February. Okay. To 2021. And we started this mid in mid-December uh, 2020 last year. Praise God. And every single day. We intercede. You know, in, in order for me to drive out a demon from somebody, that person doesn't have to be in front of me. Let me cough right now. I think a demon wants to come out. <coughs> Get out. <laughs> come out, Jezebel. <laughs> Thank you, Jesus. Oh, man. That's, that's cool, huh? Well, here's the thing. In order for me to drive out a demon, do, I, do you have to be in front of me? No. <laughs> you can be sleeping in that uh, you know, bedroom filled, filled with demons right there. You know? Why is your bedroom filled with demons? Well, look at what you watch there. Look at the, the stuff that you watch on your phone. Of course, your, your bedroom and your living room and your kitchen is all full of devils. When are you going to get converted? When are you going to get born again? Huh? Some of you keep playing around, you know. You expect me to drive out your demons. Well, I can drive out demons, but guess what? The Bible says they come back. What are you going to do next after they come back? And how long will it take for them to come back? Well, it can be a minute. It can be an hour. It can be a day. It can be also a couple of days. Who knows? You know, we cast them out, but if their door is wide open, well, then, folks, you need to get closer to Jesus. You need to walk with God. Forget about that stinking Netflix, man. 
Walk with Jesus, man. Praise God. Hallelujah. Let's knock some there. Well, it's better to have Brother Carlos knock your devils out than somebody else. You know, one one of those light duty, you know, deliverance ministers. That I call them light duty. You know, they, they, they're they soft on demons. Demon, can you come out, please? <laughs> have you seen those guys that are soft on demons? Can you come out, demon, please? Please come out. Come out, demon. Am I, am I light duty on demons? Soft on demons? No, huh? Watch my videos that I recorded 10 years ago. Watch them. Brother Carlos casting out your demons. Watch those. The old ones. Watch them. Huh? I, I, I still knock devils out the same way. I have not changed it. All right. Are you ready now to be set free from demons? Amen. You better shut the doors behind them, okay? Praise God. Now, they're going to come out now because I'm going to cast them out in the name of Jesus Christ. And they know that I have authority to drive them out. That's why they're going to come out. It doesn't matter where you are. You can be in China, in, in South Africa. It doesn't matter. You don't even have to be here with me. They're going to come out. Why? Because they hear my voice. They hear when I speak through my real voice right here. My real voice comes out of here. Okay, that's my real That's what they hear. This one here, psh, all right? This one here, they hear every word they speak, okay? My mind. My mind is the portion of me that was made in the image of God. Praise God. My mind is the way I communicate with God and, and with evil spirits too. Because when I drive them, you know, I'm here by myself. Do you think I'm going to open my mouth for what? I open my mouth to eat burritos. But to drive out demons, do I have to open my mouth if I'm here by myself, alone? No, I speak with my real mouth right here, okay? This is the real mouth, okay? Okay, I think, and the message comes across, and they jump out of people. Isn't that great, folks? How come they don't teach you that kind of stuff? They teach you about Jezebel, don't they? They're so confused. How, about, how come they don't, they don't teach you how to drive out demons through your mind? They don't teach that, do they? Of course not. They don't know. They don't know. Okay. They, they're still in the elementary school level. Okay. I already graduated 10 times. All right. I know what I'm doing. Satan knows what I'm doing. He knows. He knows. He's watching me right now, by the way. Well, there comes that Brazilian guy again. You know, Dimas. Stand by. Let's just listen to him. And let's see how far he goes this time. Ah, man. You see? You've got to be bold and you've got to know what you're doing. Okay? Are you listening to the Holy Spirit? Huh? You better get born again at brothercarlos.com. That's the website to get born again. Go there. Go there. Go there and be happy. Amen. Let me go ahead and drive out your demons right now. The Bible says, in the book of Luke, chapter 10, verse 19, I have given you authority to trample on snakes and scorpions and to overcome all the power of the enemy and not to harm you. Come out, evil spirits. Come out, evil spirits. Come out, evil spirits. Demons and devils. Get out. Come out. Come out, coronavirus. Come out, coronavirus. Come out, pork demons, pork meat demons. Get out now, addiction to pork meat. That unclean thing right there. Get out now, evil spirits. Come out, bacon demons. Go to the pit now, bacon demons. Go to the pit. Go to the pit. You've been deceiving that people. Making, you know, telling them that it's okay to eat bacon. It's, so, it's okay to eat, you know, maggots through, you know, pork meat. It's okay to eat tapeworms through pork meat. You've been telling, you've been lying to their brain. And they buy everything you tell them, don't they, demons? You know what you're doing, right, demons? But they don't know what they're doing. Okay, they watch Netflix, okay? They listen to, 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 to dead again pastors. Dead again pastors, okay? They don't know what they're doing. That's why they're filled with demons. Filled with maggots. 
filled with tapeworms, filled with tapeworm eggs, traveling all over their bodies and head and brain. They don't know any better, do they, demons? And, and, and you are behind that, aren't you, demons? You, you, you taught them how to eat pork when you were just, what, little toddler, huh? Yeah, demon, a demon, I know, demon. I know what you're doing. Okay, that's why I go after you, devils. That's why I arrest you. That's why I arrest the financial demons for 30 days. That's powerful right there, right, devils? Devils, when I arrest you for 30 days, what happened? <laughs> tell them now, speak into their minds and tell them, what happened when I arrest you for 30 days? Huh? <laughs> you know, they don't. They're so confused. They're so confused. They like noise. The more noise you make, the more they like, man. They don't like the truth, okay? They don't like, you know, uh, revelation, substance. They don't pay attention to that. They pay attention to no noise. <laughs> hey, let's make some noise. <laughs> No wonder demons love your home. No wonder demons love you. Huh? When are you going to be born again? When? After Jesus comes back, it's going to be too late for you. I'm here to help. I'm here to knock your devils out, but you need to keep them out. You keep them out. I cast them out on your behalf. You keep them out. Come out, evil spirits. Come out, infirmity. Come out, sickness and disease. Come out, tapeworm, the eggs, demons. Go to the pit now. 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 Come out. Come out, spirit of death. Come out, premature death. Come out, flu. Come out, allergies. Go to the pit now. Go to the pit now. Come out now, sexual immorality, sexual impurity. Go to the pit now, pornography. Come out, drug addiction, alcohol addiction. Come out, substance addiction demons. Go to the pit, 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 go to the pit. Go now, go now in Jesus' name. Come out in Jesus' mighty name. Come out of their family members, those dead people right there. They're, they walk, but they're dead. They watch TV, but they're dead. Get out of them right now because I'm casting you out. Get out now. From those who have signed up here. Okay? Those who have signed up here. Come out of them. Come out of their family members, those, those, those dead people right there. They're dead. They walk around, but they're dead. They're, they're totally dead. They don't know anything about life. That's why they read horoscope. Get out. Get out, evil spirits. Come out, yoga demons. Come out now, horoscope devils. Come out, new age devils. Come out now, occult demons. Go to the pit now, psychic ability devils. Go now in Jesus' mighty name. Come out, financial demons. Get out now and go to the pit now. 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 Go now in Jesus' mighty name. Take a deep breath right now. Come out, demons. Come out, devils. Come out, witchcraft. Only three times. Say amen. Write amen below. In the comment area, right below the right, amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Are you going to get converted uh, anytime soon? Uh, are you going to give your heart to Christ wholeheartedly anytime soon? Or are you waiting for Satan to kill you and then after the fact you want to give your heart to Christ? That will be too late. I'm telling you that right now. Okay. All right. Is, is, is your lifestyle so good that you are, you are you're, you're giving, having some resistance to the gospel of Christ? 
It's because your life it, 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 it's it's a it's a it's a it's a sea of roses right now. I bet it's not. Your life is miserable. Okay, you are always tormented and oppressed and depressed. Why? Because you keep listening to Satan. When are you going to wake up, folks? All right, say amen. Write amen down there. If you have not signed up here, sign up, okay? At least I am driving out your demons. Now keep them out. Do yourself a favor. Keep them out. And keep coming back here. Listen to more. I got I got way more videos on YouTube right now. 30 day intensive deliveries. Listen, listen to them all. It doesn't hurt. Listen to them. Okay. Listen to them. All right. Noise. It will not set you free. Too much noise out there. It will you make you more confused. Okay. Listen to the Holy Spirit. Let me pray a final prayer right now. Father, I ask for now that you seal this deliverance. And that you fill every empty spot vacated by unclean spirits with the presence of the Holy Spirit in everyone's bodies, minds, souls, and spirits, and their family members, and my family members, in Jesus' mighty name. In Jesus' mighty name. Write amen down there below in the comment area. Write amen. Write praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. I want you to write that. Praise the Lord there. I want to see that. Praise the Lord. Amen. All right. Now wake up and smell the coffee from heaven. Amen. God bless you now. And have a good day by now.